want to introduce you to Coco. Yep, he's a nice little fella. And of course, Sugar Bear, the rowdy guy. Anyways, Sugar Bear and I, Sugar Bear's 14 months old, and uh, Coco, I think he's somewhere between three, around three years old, three, three and a half maybe. Um, Sugar Bear and I, I'm retired, so we decided we would uh, help a rescue and then it would, when the opportunity arose. So looks like we might even be able to help a lot of uh, rescues. But Coco's a sweet little fella. He loves affection. He'll curl up beside you on the couch. I think he'd be good with little kids four or five years old. Very patient. Uh, he's a lovely little dog. And he'll get along with other dogs, but I think his first his first reaction is his fear, so he might nip out at a new new friend. I would be happy to uh, introduce them and get them used to each other uh, and do it safely with no concern. Because uh, he was nipping at Bear when Bear come around, but Bear knows how to avoid him and, you know, give him a chance to understand that it's just play that he wants. And so now they're, they're the best of buddies, as you can see. Hey, so a bear's a hundred pound German Shepherd. He's, he's uh, aside from a bit of a allergy issue on his skin there, um, he's in athletic condition. And, uh, you know, he's always been trained to be a good dog. Uh, <laughs> dealing with the energy that he has can be a, a chore at times, but I'm teaching Coco, he, he knows the word lay down, he knows sit, uh, he knows quiet, that's very important. He's house trained, but you gotta watch him right off the bat. His first instinct is to spray, so you gotta catch him that first time, and he won't do it again in the house. I would recommend that if you adopted him, that you, you take him out many times in a day for the first week or so, just to give him a place to, to do, do it properly, so he doesn't feel the urge to uh, mark in the house. Now I'm going to work with him for a while and um, make him a, a smarter dog. I'm, I'm going to try and teach him to dance on his hind legs because he's little enough to do it and I think he would do it for a treat. So anyways, that's uh, Sugar Bear. This is uh, Coco. She's a little shepherd mix. I, I think she's a perfect little dog. Or, or, I'm sorry, he, he. It's a he and uh, he's fixed. But uh, yeah, a young family with a couple of young kids, this, he would be perfect for them. Very protective and uh, playful and very affectionate. He'll probably go curl up to a, a small child and sleep with them. So, um, folks, if you see this fellow, don't pass him up. He, he's a great catch.